FCT Minister of State Dr. Rahmatu Tijani Aliyu reminded that earlier in June this year, the flag of ceremony of the program was performed in Kuali, while pledging that the FCT administration would continue to commit ample human and financial resources towards ensuring poverty reduction and improvement of livelihoods for poor and vulnerable agricultural households in the FCT. It is gratifying to know that the Federal Country Territory Administration has allocated the sum of $4.5 million to the FCT Father Market. $4.5 million is no joke. And I hear it is sounding applause for beneficiaries. <laughs> to implement three disbursement linked indicators, DLIs, out of a total allocation of $15 million made available to the FCTA by the World Bank for implementation of the FCT. Program. Also speaking, the FCTA Permanent Secretary, Mr. Olushadi Adeshola, noted that the federal government and the FCT administration have invested time and resources in the Fadama Cares program and it has started yielding tangible results. It is therefore heartwarming for us in FCT that the FCT Cares program with the federal government of Nigeria and FCT administration have invested time and resources and started yielding tangible results. In his remarks, Secretary Agricultural and Rural Development Secretariat of the FCTA, Malam Abubakar Ibrahim, reiterated that this achievement is another significant milestone in the efforts of the FCT administration towards supporting the attainment of food and nutritional security in the Federal Capital Territory. It is my singular honor and privilege to welcome you all this important occasion, which marks the achievement of yet another significant milestone in the effort of the FCT administration toward supporting the attainment of food and nutrition security in the FCTA. The items to be distributed include fertilizers, seeds and agrochemicals, sp sprayers and personal protective equipment for crop farmers, day-old chicks and feeds for poultry farmers, juveniles and feeds for fish farmers, goats for livestock farmers, grinding machines for women processors and motorized produce threshers for groups of unemployed youths. Usman Khatun Umar, Aso Television News.